Hello, I am Nindy Kerr from Nindy's Creative Corner. Welcome to my first Stamping 101 video. Stampin' Up! has just reconfigured their classic stamping pads. I am so excited for these new ink pads. Let's start with the case. It is the same flip top style we are used to. There is now a shiny label on the top and no label on the end. We get to put that on ourselves. Peel off the corner by the barcode. Peel off the sticker. The top one is English. There are four languages that Stampin' Up! sells to, so you get your choice of four languages. Make sure the words are upright and adhere to the top portion of the lower end. If you don't get it positioned just the way you want it, it is easily repositionable at first. There we go. You can use the other labels as desired. Some have put their labels up here at the top. Some have cut off a portion of their label and stuck on the inside right here. So they could easily tell at a glance which color their ink pad is. Now let's try out our new Stampin' Pads. I will use the new Gumball Green. Let's test out a line stamp first. Lightly tap a couple of times. Remember, lightly tap but firmly press, just not too hard. Check to make sure there are no, there's no ink along the edges of your stamp. Press firmly. And look what a great image you get. Let's try a solid stamp now. With the solid stamps, I usually hold them a little bit longer. Twist slightly. Check for stray ink around the edges and stamp. This is what a stamped image should look like. Great the first time. The new Stampin' Pads are available in all of Stampin' Up's colors. The old ink, the old reinkers will work with all but five of the new Stampin' Pads. Those colors are Basic Black, Basic Gray, Marina Mist, Perfect Plum, and Tempting Turquoise. You will need to use the new reinkers with those new firm foam pads. The new reinkers can be used with all the older Stampin' Pads. You can easily tell the difference between the older and new Stampin' Pads when they are in your color caddy by looking at the end. The bottom, classic is written along the bottom. With the new ones, they all have their names. So we can easily tell the difference. You can order some of the new Firm Foam Stampin' Pads from my online Stampin' Up! store, nindykerr.stampinup.net. There's a link on the sidebar. Have fun playing with your new Firm Foam Stampin' Pads and enjoy the improved quality of your stamped images. Happy stamping!